this is exciting. The three of you have agreed to write a song for Game of Games for our next season. So um, I don't know if you've rhymed Degenerous yet, if that's easy, if it's hard. Um, but do you have anything in mind yet? I have some that's chords. Uh, Shane, do you have some lyrics or any concepts? I do. I, I mean, I have to be, I have to tell you, <laughs> I am like crazy Game of Games fan. It's the only thing that, that my husband and I and our two kids can agree on to watch together. No joke. I mean, yeah. I would say that even if it weren't true, because I'm sitting in front of race. You watch the RuPaul Drag Race. I love that. Well, I can't watch that with the kids. <laughs> Those kids, they talk too dirty. But, uh, you know, I, um, right before we got on here, because, I mean, you know, you see what Esther and Ryan and I do on the show. We can't help ourselves. And sometimes in between takes, we're kind of just, we're kind of just messing around and writing something. So I was writing a little, a little out of my nerves. Let's hear it. I was writing a fancy thing that was like, put me on the game of games, knocking boots or make it rain. I can make it anywhere, even in musical chairs. I'm finally gonna make a name. Put me on the game of games. All right, now. That's what I was trying to do. I like it. I like it. I like we to gotta, put me on the game of games. You remember that old song, Put Me on the Cover of the Rolling Stone? That's what I was thinking about. Yep. What kind of, like, like is it supposed to be exciting? Like, how are we, like, Ryan, what do you have? I mean, no, I, I yeah, we wanted to ask some questions, Ellen, specifically. So any good songwriter, any good songwriter does their yep. research. We're, we're telling micro stories, so we have to do our research. So what, give us some trigger words uh, that, that you want us to implement some, Obviously, we know the show. We're fans of the show. But tell us some things that you yeah. want from us. <laughs> well, um, obviously, they fly through the air. They drop down uh, very far. Um, they get very dirty. Dirty. Um, those are, we, you know, you know what happens what to them. Drop down and get um, dirty with it. <laughs> I think it could be like. Yeah, get, drop down and get dirty. I like that. Um, but basically, just describe what happens to the people and make it, and, and it, it should sound horrible. And at the very end, it turns out it's a good thing. <laughs> so it could be kind of like, uh, it could be something like this. If we go the more pop route, the possibility I have these chords. Oh, good. And this kind of melody. I want to fly through the air. I want to get dirty, dirty, dirty. I don't care. want to get free. Yep. That kind oh, of a, we'll do a I dance record. Drop, I don't want yeah. to fight. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. I love it. Oh, my God. All right. Listen, do you understand? I have Pink, who wrote and sings the theme song for my show, and now I have you three doing game of games. I need to keep coming up with games and, and shows and stuff so I can have every yes. artist that I admire write songs. I love the three of you. I love Songland. Um, the finale of Songland airs June 15th at 10 o'clock on NBC. And if you haven't watched it, start from the beginning because every single one of the shows, you, you, you're you guessing who they're going to pick and what song is the best. You have opinions, but they're all good. And anyway, I love y'all. I love Songland. Thank you so much. Thanks for watching. Uh, listen to one another and be kind to one another.